business with a twist. Yeah, it's a full house on this opening day of Cafe Appalachia. 13 News reporter Jesse Schaefer live in South Charleston for us tonight with more on how this new restaurant is changing lives. Jesse. Patrick, Adrian, it's always exciting when new local restaurants pop up, right? New menu items, new experiences. Well, this restaurant here behind me, they're doing something pretty special. You want to check this out for yourselves. Coffee, a menu full of nutritious, locally grown food, and an old church full of smiling, happy faces. Cafe Appalachia is just as innovative as the menu is delicious. It's taken some time for owner Cheryl Laws to get it off the ground. It's a baby. That's why I said I'm giving birth. Nine months. The open kitchen there, it's staffed with folks who are recovering from addiction. People like Emily, the cafe's barista. She uh, is in long-term recovery, and the, the reintegration part is the hardest part for her, finding people where she can be who she is. So that's what Laws and her nonprofit Pollinate is focusing on, that reintegration back Back into society after rehab. Three. All right. The cafe is one of Pollinate's ventures. It's modeled after one that Law spent much of her time in while she was getting her master's degree from Appalachian State University. And as for the pricing, here it's about paying what you can afford. If you can afford a little bit more, pay a little bit more. That'll go to feed somebody else. More than anything, the owners here hope that you take home maybe some leftovers, but also that sense of community that they say is lacking sometimes in our society today. Laws has had the opportunity to do a lot of things in a number of cities, but she's chosen to come back to Southern Appalachia to make a difference here. This might make me want to cry, but I have granddaughters here, and they need me, you know, and I want to know them. And I love this place. Like, this, this is where I grew up, you know, and I can, I think that if you are given the kind of heart to help, especially in the world right now, you have to use your medicine. So just in case you want to check out Cafe Appalachia here behind me, we're in the 200 block of D Street. They're open Monday through Friday for lunch and for coffee, and then Saturdays for coffee only. I will be right back here at 6 o'clock. Make sure you stay tuned. We've got everything on our website right now, WOWKTV.com. But for now, live in South Charleston, I'm Jesse Schaefer, 13 News, working for you.